who's to blame when someone cheats, the married man or woman or the other person that's involved? Um, the married man or woman, absolutely, because you're the one that stood at an altar or wherever and made your vows and your commitment. Um, and, you know, I know I'm a Mrs. Old Sensible Knickers, but my, one of my favourite phrases is, love is a decision, not just a feeling. Mm. And I think, you know, when you either cheat or put yourself in a compromising situation that can make it look as though you have intentions that are not honourable to your marriage, then you've made a decision to do that. Um, you know, and we don't know the sort of exact details of this, um, whether it was cheating as in, you know, she says that they kissed and cuddled, but he's not said anything. Um, but either way, I just, you know, I, I, I kind of feel sorry for Colleen. She's pregnant with their fourth child, and whether anything happened or not, you just kind of think, why would you put yourself in that situation when your wife is away on holiday with your children? Why would you even get in a car with, with, with another woman? Because it can be misconstrued.